What would you do if you had a time button that could take you exactly 10 seconds into the past? In this episode, Fry, Leela, and Bender visit the moon's amusement park, where Leela has a near-death experience that prompts Fry to propose to her. Meanwhile, Professor Farnsworth invents the time button and demonstrates its power by stealing $10 from Zwaberg. Fry and Bender use the button to steal diamonds for an engagement ring. Fry presents the ring to Leela in a clam at Elzer's, but the clam snaps shut, severing her hand. Fry uses the time button to prevent this and proposes again, asking her to meet him at the Vampire State Building. Heartbroken when Leela appears to be late, Fry jumps from the skyscraper. As he falls, he sees Leela arriving early and realizes his watch didn't account for the time button's effect. Fry dies, and a distraught Leela uses the time button to send him back into the sky. Bender devises a plan to use his airbag to save Fry, which works, but Fry lands on the time button, freezing except for himself and Leela. The couple get married and spend their lives traveling the world ultimately growing old together. The professor, who has been tunneling through the frozen timeline, finds Fry and Leela and repairs the time button. He modifies it to undo the entire affair, erasing their memories of the incident. Fry asks Leela if she wants to go around again, and she responds I do. They share a final kiss, knowing they will have another lifetime together, and with one press of the button, the timeline is negated itself. So, 